we were, but but they were, we were watching, we were watching through. We watched this like the, the, the music, the musical performances, and oh, I gotta, I gotta start with Queen. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay, listen. Here's okay. the thing. Yeah. Adam Lambert's not Freddie Mercury. No, he's not. This is my, this is the thing. Can everybody stop saying that? No, no, no. A fact. But wait, but wait, but wait. <laughs> Quite literally. Here's the here's the thing. The performance itself was good. It's fine. It's a good performance, sure. and the kid's a performer. Sure. He just doesn't do it for me. Yeah. Like yeah. it's just it's. I feel like I'm watching a Broadway play when he's when he's singing. And that was when we went because we went. Remember, you gave me the tickets for it. We oh, went right. to see Queen at the Hollywood Bowl. And, and, yeah, how, and with it was Adam like, Lambert. The exact same thing. We both walked out. We're like, listen, I've seen a lot of karaoke performances of Queen songs, and it was pretty much the exact same yeah, thing we just saw. Is. Because he is a Broadway performer, yeah. he doesn't have the rock star. He's a great player. He's a, a great performer. Great performer. But he just doesn't have that Freddie Mercury on stage, and that's the same problem I have with the guy in Journey. He's not Steve Perry. Right. That's that's all. Fact it, again. It, it's tough. I know. I'm just it, saying there wasn't like for me for Queen for I that kind it. of a thing. What Rami Malek did as Freddie Mercury on stage in a in a movie, and I get there's editing and all that kind of stuff. He didn't sing. He was. He didn't sing. But I'm just saying his performance as Freddie Mercury right. on that stage was. Probably better well, than what I've seen from Adam Lambert. What I think is really cool, taking out Adam Lambert for a second, like you're watching Brian. Yeah, that like, was yeah. that is that was cool. Yeah. Unreal. That was cool. I and love that he kept the same hair, which is great. It, it's amazing. It rocks it so hard, yeah. and like he's the one of the best of all time. Well, they so, what they said though, you know, that like, I and I always I, I talk I rave about the guy, but I never remember the guy's name. The guy who uh, sounds just like Freddie Mercury that yeah, I play I on the show all the time. It. It may be Ben. I have no idea, but he plays. So that guy actually was hired by Queen, and they play in like a like a cover band for Queen because th there's been arguments of why doesn't he sing for them? And the the explanation was that Brian and those guys they don't want another Freddie Mercury. They don't want someone to sound like Freddie. They wanted to. Have, this is, so what's this guy's name again? Mark Martell. Play him again. I, I got you. Got to play him. Mark Martell. Yeah, Mark Martell. We should remember that. Yeah, That's we got it. You got to play him. But let's, you just listen to. Have you heard this, Makuga? No. Oh, That's so good. He looks like him too. Is this yeah. The His mouth, life? right? Is this just fantasy? Caught in a landslide. Give him the job. I, know. I, I can watch it for two more seconds. I get it. Yeah, but he does perform. He performs in a band that was hired by Queen. They make money off of it, obviously, but like he just doesn't perform with Queen. Um, Adam Lambert is a different. Tone what they want, but this yeah. is what they want. It. That's what Queen wants right now. I just it doesn't. I didn't respond to it. I think he's. A, and I'm not saying he's bad. I think he's a good performer. I, not his manager. No, I know. No, I'm just saying. But I know that you're. But from he's he's not Freddie Mercury. He's no, not. And they, fact. They, they don't want him to be Freddie Mercury. Fact again. So I just want as it opened up, and I'm sure that when you're in the crowd, it's a lot of fun. But I really felt like it was watching American Idol. Yeah, I agree. I don't agreed, know yeah. about watching them at the bowl, but what I do know is seeing them in the Vegas residency is so different because I'm literally standing. I'm. Uh, he was closer to me. Adam Lambert was closer to me than Christian is to me right yeah. now. Like that far away. And he is so talented in his own right. He is. That if, to me, it just did it. Yeah. Now, was it, would I, did I wish it was Freddie Mercury? Yeah, obviously. Right. But it's not. So I, I feel bad for him because so many tweets last night like, y you're not Freddie Mercury. That's not fair. Uh -huh. Yeah, that's not. You know, and, and, and uh -huh. I feel bad saying yeah. that he a great performer, all that kind you of stuff. You don't prefer him. And I, I, yeah, 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 I get that's, it. That's, that's how I feel. And, that's it's it. like, and it's also because we were talking about last night, my wife and I, was that my top three, I think, front men of all time. Jim Morrison, mm -hmm. Freddie Mercury, and Mick Jagger. Those okay. are my three. 